What's wrong, Carly Beth? <laughs> the mask! It won't come off! Carly Beth! Carly Beth! If someone can tell me who Carly Beth is without Googling it, I will have redeemed faith once again in the world. What's up, guys? No handlebars here. Playing some ground war, 9v9, me rolling with seven of the, mo of the crew members and two randos. And I'm pretty sure this is a full party of nine on the enemy team, so I absolutely had to pull out the M60 big ammo. And you guys are probably like, I've never seen a big ammo attachment. And that could be for two reasons. One, you've never used the M60. Or two, it's not called big ammo, it's called extended mags. And look at me like a boss, Rush B, like a boss, because I'm a boss. Redundantly, redundant statement is redundant. But yeah. This thing is really cool, and Edge is shooting around like crazy because somebody gave him a spoiler that-, that SPOILER! Dumbledore died in one of the Harry Potter movies, so he's really upset. He's shooting around his M60 like crazy. So- WHOA 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 WHOA! What the hell is that? THIS is a correct Pikachu emblem. THIS is a Pissachu emblem. Emphasis on piss. Anyway. Yeah, M60 Big Ammo is like one of the most awesomest of awesome classes that you can use. Oh yeah, I'm still rolling with Trogdor. I'm rolling with Flak Jacket, Pro, Steady Aim Pro, and Marathon Pro. And someone gets a spy plane and look at me like waddle away like a penguin, unfortunately, to no avail. But yeah, the reason I'm not using Slate of Hand Pro is because if you look closely, I have all 200 bullets in one shot and no reload, so I don't have to reload fast. And look at Edge is so pissed off. No, Dumbledore! He gets like a triple spray. Ah, poor Edge. Yeah, so I jump again. The flag because I'm a boss. Shoot my teammate because he's not jumping the flag with us. You see me still running with Trogdor because this is the same game. I don't change my emblems like until every other gaming session. So this is the same gaming session as the last one. And look at me get clipped like a boss by Miss Tac Man. But yeah, whatever. I think I'd rather use Slate of Hand Pro over Steady Aim Pro, but it's more awesome to spray and pray. It makes you look like a douche. Wait, wait a minute. Crap. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> so yeah, these guys are actually uh, pretty good, even though we're beating them right now, like 40 to 16. These guys are not pushovers. They are in a full party. Now, I saw a guy on the flag, and I thought that he wanted that, my teammate wanted that kill, so I left him. And somehow my teammate didn't see him. But that's okay, because Chris... Edge got him, so it's okay. It's all good. Yeah, the M60, it's like a two-shot kill up close. It and Actually, it's a two-shot kill from all, all, kill, all areas. I don't think I've ever... Oh, did somebody shoot at me? Hold on a second. I don't run away from duels unwillingly and unknowingly. I lost my whole train of thought right there. Wow. Yeah, okay. Now, because we are double-capped, like, the correct choice of action for me was to hold out in this building, which I call Grandma's Building. And for those of you who don't know why I call this grandma's building, PLANTING CLAYMORE! See the building I'm staring at right now? Whoa, there's two of them! Oh, 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 did you shoot at me? Nah! Nah! Not allowed to run away from that duel. And he's trying to hide, so I have to keep firing. Not, I'll dishonor my family. But yeah, that building I was shooting at just now? Oh, and Edge gets another triple feed there. Dumbledore! No! Yeah. So, the reason that building over there is called Grandpa's House. And the one I'm in right now is called Grandma's House. And the reason for that is because Grandma lost the divorce settlement. So Grandpa got a three-story house. And Grandma stuck with this house with a small little high-rise. Oh, yeah. So anyway. Oh, Roaring Wookiee gets attack dogs. But around this area, I pick up a FAMAS. <gasps> FAMAS! The FAMAS. Oh, the FAMAS. Uh, yeah, I'm not allowed to use the FAMAS. That's what I get for using the FAMAS. And, yeah. So anyway, I got the African-American bird, but it doesn't matter because Edge's African-American bird's up there. He loves his M60. And I think a lot of us are using the M60. Roaring Wookiee's going with Olympia. Lucid Sky Diamond's rolling with the M60. Crispy Tempur is going MP5. And Senti Roth is rolling with a Scorpion, which is an awesome gun. And look at me just steady aim this guy like a, like a monster boss. And... Get a couple nice sprays with it. I don't know. It's it's a really underrated gun. It's like all I can really say about it. And you see me there, like all confused, trying to spray and all that mop, yada yada. And before I can call in my African American bird, Roaring Wookie calls in his African American bird. Oh, there's so many dogs dead on the floor. I have to like leave this building for fear of like just crying. And our teammate, the one, the two randoms that we have on our team, 
figure to themselves, Self, this is domination. The object of domination is to dominate the enemy team. Like, even though the object of the game is domination, don't go take the third flag. Keep B and keep either A or C. Give them a flag. Did somebody shoot at me? Oh, somebody flashed me! I love winning flashed duels. Oh, and look at me like a grade A boss. Is that the word of the day, boss? Oh, look at that guy Squirtle Emblem! That's what I'm talking about, man. That's what I'm talking about. Unlike that piss chew emblem. Yeah, whatever. So yeah, so now we lost A and B. See, C on this map is mucho bado, and that's Spanish for very, very bad. So, you're not allowed to take C because it's in the middle of a field. You spawn bad, and it's easier to defend B from A. See, see what I'm saying? L let me break that down in layman's terms. It's easier to defend Bravstar from Ambrose if you lose Carlito. Actually, that didn't really help too much, but yeah. So this guy, I, I ran by the flag to make make their screen say, LOSING ARLITO! And then I ran by and then I killed him. That's what I get. It's, that's called bait and switch with no switch. So it's just called bait. <laughs> but yeah. So now I'm one away from a blackbird, so I call in my blackbird. <gasps> RACIST! I mean African-American bird. I'm one away and because I'm caught up with my political correctness, I get killed one away from the African-American bird. Woot. So yeah. Now, once again, teammates feel the need to take C. So, yeah. And I got killed once again from that window, so I decided to make it a mission to go back into Grandma's balcony and not allow anybody to kill me from that window or my teammates from that window. So I gotta go back up onto Grandma's balcony. And I don't know what- now all- we were just losing, now all of a sudden we're triple capping him, I'm confused now. And see, I see this guy's gun sticking out, man, we're in the world's car in San Diego. Oh, San Diego? Like, exactly. So now, I see one of my teammates in that building there. And I'm like, alright, let me just try to kill, trap these guys in the field since we have B and, B and A. And see, Dillonocalypse there, our marksman has a very special power on our crew. He is allowed to call a hit once per gaming session. So in, out of a course of eight games, he can call one hit. So it's like a marksman. So I'm trying to bait out the guy that he called the hit on. And I was like, is that him? No. Death machine spinning up. Is that him? No. I feel bad for that guy's death machine, but... Yeah, so, whenever Dylanocalypse calls a hit, I am not allowed to move, I must kill the guy that he called the hit on. And because of that, I didn't see that we were losing Gravstar, which is okay. Because my teammates are, like, flocking over to it on the radar, so we're gonna grab it in a sec. And we also take Ambrose, which is cool. And I'm still looking for this guy, I don't know who it is. He just, he, Dylanocalypse told me he's camping it out in this building. So I'm just gonna try to shoot around blindly, bait him out. And I think that was the guy, Roaring Wookiee knifes him in the face, which is kind of disappointing, because I'm supposed to be the one who gets the hit. But yeah, it doesn't matter. And look at- man, look at that! Look at that, what is that? <laughs> Spray and pray, man, slay the hand would have probably benefited me more there. But it is pretty awesome to have steady aim. So I call on Los Lobos. I'm contemplating right now whether or not I should call in the the chopper gunner, aka Big Bird. And I'm, I'm gonna say, you know what? I'm gonna wait till we get to 180, and once we get to the 180 mark, I'm gonna call it in. So it should have just enough time to end it with a bang. Dog's doing a pretty good job too. And like, yeah, now we finally lost C, which is the way it's supposed to be. That's pro that's the best setup. Planting Claymore! Now you see me eyeing the clock like Hawkeye's my hawk. And now, call him Big Bird. Dun 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 Yeah, that was supposed to be our official Canadian mongoose theme song, but yeah, whatever. So yeah, all these guys start flocking back to cover, which is good because now they can't collect the flags. And it kind of disappoints me that nobody was able to shoot me down, so the game might end with, Ooh, you just used a chopper gunner against a bunch of kids, but they were a party of nine, so I guess the only really justification I have to upload this game so that I'm not bullying anybody. I'm always like that. I don't like to upload games where it looks like I'm just killing kids to get a high score and then I... I'm a family man. I love kids. If you're a kid, let's game. Yeah, yeah. I I love Gosling. But yeah. So if you haven't added us on Facebook, please add us on Facebook. We can chat. We can tell you when we're gaming. All the usual yada yada. And please leave a comment. I love comments. Comments are awesome. And look at this guy. Check those corners. You you have no idea how awesome people would be at this game if they just check their corners. Also, when you plant a claymore, yell out, PLANTING CLAYMORE! <laughs> God, that thing's stuck in my head now, man. You guys got that in my head.
Specifically one person. You know who you are. But yeah. All right, that's the game. Final score, 66 and 7. Hope you guys enjoyed. Till next time. Adios.